Hey guys, so today's video, if you can't tell already, is going to be an updated makeup collection. I did this video about almost exactly a year ago, and pretty much everything has changed since then. I got a whole new setup and all new like storage and stuff. So I hope you guys like this video, and yeah, let's just get on into it. Okay, so basically I'm just gonna go through like this whole side of the room is my desk and makeup organization. I have other like hair tools and school related things so I'm just gonna take you through all that. So starting here is just this shelving little thing. I don't know what to call it but it has a little door here. So, inside, this top shelf has all of my nail stuff. This little thing has a bunch of, like, travel, little sample size nails, and I have, like, a cuticle balm. This whole perfume box is filled with nail polish. So there, if you can see, that's where I keep my enormous collection of nail polish. And then this side has, when I used to do my own fake nails at home, I have those there, I have acrylics now. And then more nail polishes that don't fit in that perfume box. This bin has a lot of school things. There's extra pencils and some flashcards I made for like random finals. And then these flosser pick things. Uh, just stuff like that. There's extra index cards. And then here I got this little set from Ulta one year that had makeup in it. So, whoops. So I took out the makeup and just used the train case for other storage, but this is the makeup that it came with. And then this bin has my hot tools. It just has a straightener and a curling iron. These are the ones I use most often. The rest of them are like in the bathroom. Um, a dry shampoo, this mousse, and then another dry shampoo back there. And then this next little bin on the lower shelf just has a bunch of lotion and body products pretty much. So that's that. This bin I'm not even going to get into. It just has storage stuff. It's just like so miscellaneous. And then down there is more storage stuff. I have my old Nintendo and then that binder has extra lined and graph paper. So it's messy, but with this part of the door, it covers it when it's closed, so it doesn't really matter. So this is the desk. It is just a black desk. Like I said, I use this for makeup and for school. I'm online school, so I do my work here. So this is just the computer that my online school supplied me. I have this desktop. Most of the time I use my MacBook, but this is here just if I want to use it. And then back there, that is a little lamp that I use for filming. It's a really good light for filming. And then there's this other lamp. And I have this little stuffed guinea pig. We saw it at the store. I don't know why I have it, but yeah. I have some hand sanitizer. This is Sugar Lemon Fizz from Bath & Body Works. I really like the ones with the pump. Just have some pens and pencils in here. I have this Batiste plumping powder. It's a dry shampoo. And then this new lotion I got from Soap & Glory. It's the Righteous Butter Body Lotion, which I'm obsessed with. And then I just have my little mirror. I'm wearing a flannel right now. So there's that and it's obviously it flips to the other side. Next to that I have all of my lipsticks which I really need to get more because I mean there's only two spots there and that's because those lipsticks are in my purse. So I either need more lipstick storage here or just more storage like in my actual makeup storage. Then I have the purple EOS lip balm that I use every day. Here I have my brushes. There's eye brushes here and face brushes here. They probably need to be washed. You can see the powder on this one. But 
I just keep those there. These ones, if you're wondering, I got these for a Christmas present one time. They're really, really cute, but the brushes actually suck. Like, I rarely use the brushes, so they're just kind of a cute, like, decoration. And then I have a pencil sharpener. This is legit, like, 25 cents pencil sharpener for my eyeliners. And then if you've seen the, the Impress stick-on nails, they come in a cute little, like, nail polish, plastic little nail polish thing. So I saved that and just put bobby pins in it. And then I have this magazine holder with my most used palettes in here. I've got the Naked 3 palette, this Contour palette from NYX. And I just keep my beauty blender there. And then I have these makeup wipes. These are just from the Equate brand. They're a knockoff for the, uh, the simple cleansing wipes. And then I have my planner. I just got this from Barnes & Noble. And then a random guinea pig magazine. And then I'll show you guys what's in this drawer right here that has in the desk. So I have my Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray, a brush cleaner, the e.l.f. setting spray, and a mini lotion. And I have these little applicators, which I like the thin tip on them for when I mess up my eyeliner. It's very good for cleaning that up. I have a brush here. It has some fake lashes, some clear elastics, and then like a coupon from Bare Minerals, some other things that just come with like makeup products. And then up here, I have some extra earrings and then some screws that are extra for my makeup thing. Uh, some hair ties, these uh, thumbtacks, I don't know why. Uh, this clip I used to section off my hair and tweezers and more bobby pins. So now on to the actual makeup collection. I'm sure you've seen this storage before. Everybody has this and not a whole lot of people like it. I got it for a really, really great price and I kind of agree it's not the best, but it's bigger than what I previously had. So I will enjoy it. So on the top here, I have Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin Burning. And then I have this mini candle holder that has leaves in it, but the wick is pretty much like gone on it, so I can't really burn it anymore. And then I have this little bin that has a moisturizer, a random kabuki brush. This is a lip, um, like a lip balm. And then I have the Lush Lip Scrub in Bubblegum. And then this thing, I'll lift it up to show you. This was on my old guinea pig's cage. His name was Bugsley. He passed away last year. So I just keep this here because it just reminds me of him every day. So I guess we will go right into the makeup. The top drawer is face products. I have all my foundations laid out right here. It's not my favorite way to organize them. I prefer them to be standing up, but these are too short to have that. And then I have two primers right here. I have a NYX primer and a L'Oreal primer. This little bin back here has all my BB creams. I'm obsessed with BB creams. I love trying any and every BB cream that there is out there. So that's just my collection of BB creams. And then over here, I have all of my concealers. I've got the Fit Me from Maybelline, Erase Paste, a NYX one, uh, this Match, Match Perfection from Rimmel. I have Sony Kashuk Hidden Agenda palette here that's super dirty. So that's that drawer. The second drawer is powder and blush. So in here I have my MAC powder, CoverGirl powder, Fit Me powder from Maybelline. This is my current favorite powder. It's the e.l.f. high definition powder. It's a loose translucent powder, so I love this. And then I have two bronzers right here. Here's just my plethora of blushes. There's not a whole lot of room, so if I ever get more blushes, I'm gonna need to reorganize. 
but I've just got like a Tarte blush, um, NYX cream blush. Uh, there's an e.l.f. blush here. They have like the e.l.f. Um, contour and blush duo. And they have a random powder foundation back there. And then over here is more liquid blush things. So I have like high beam right here. And then here I have a mini high beam. I have posy tint. I have this e.l.f. Uh, shimmering facial whip which is like a dupe of high beam some liquid blushes and then if you guys remember when these were super popular the Maybelline dream bounce blushes so that's just that drawer and none of my bins like match at all you can see there's like a blue one and a green one I just get random bins whatever works the next drawer is eyes I have all my eyeshadows in here this bin has single shadows right here. These are all from the brand Merle Norman, which you probably haven't heard about. It's very popular in my state, and we're friends with the people that own the company, and so we get a lot of their products. Um, I have some CoverGirl shadows and single shadows here, and then I have all of these e.l.f. quads. And then behind it is just like these little mini palettes or quads and trios and stuff like that. Here I have two e.l.f. cream shadows and a cream liner and two of my color tattoos. Here is more single shadows. There's NYX, two Urban Decay ones, and one of the Maybelline pigments. And then I also have the, some of the NYX pigments that I just keep here and a NYX shadow base and then some more quads and trios that I use. Next is eyeliners and mascara. Over here is eyeliners. There is no way they're organized. It's just liquid liners, pencil liners, like shadow sticks, pretty much every kind of liner is in here. I want to organize them, but for now they're just kind of just sitting in there. And then I have my mascaras. Sorry, my hand is really shaky. I have my mascaras, so here's my eyelash curler. And then I recently bought the Better Than Sex mascara, the travel size, so I'm excited to try it. But I've got some NYX here, Rimmel, Cover Girl. I have one from the brand Flower and Benefit. So, mascara is probably my favorite makeup product. So, this is my favorite drawer. And then below it, we are going into lips. Over here, I have these Color Rush lip balm stains from Rimmel. I have a bunch of them. I actually only have four, but I keep those there. And then I have all my NYX butter glosses just kept here. And in this bin, I have more lipsticks that won't fit in my lipstick container. And then I have a couple stains, lip stains and lip liners here. Then I've got all my NYX soft matte lip creams. And below that is like elf matte lip colors and like a tart um what are these called lip surgeons things so that's that this drawer has all my lip glosses and here it's just random squeezy tube lip glosses most of them are from bath and body works like this limeade one uh what's this one watermelon sorbet have like the winter candy apple and then I have a couple, I have the uh, Urban Decay Lip Junkie, I have one in here from like Victoria's Secret, an e.l.f. one, a Maybelline one, so just squeezy tube in there. And then here is my other lip glosses, not organized at all, but I have like Revlon, I have some MAC, um, e.l.f., I don't even know, just lip glosses in here. I have a Lorac one, and then this Vera Wang. It's like a um, perfume lips lip gloss duo, so I don't know why I just keep that in there. And then below that has all my lip balms. Back here is 
all of my EOS lip balms. I have collected every single one of them except for the mint one, which I don't really want. And then some more lip products. I have an e.l.f. conditioning lip balm, this Body Shop uh, lip butter, and this NYC lip balm thing. And then here is like on my baby lips. I have this one from e.l.f. I have a soft lips. I have one from Bath and Body Works. I have like a Burt's Bees one. Focus. Focus. Thank you. So, that's that. Why is my camera not focusing? And then, sorry if the lighting is getting bad as I go down. It's raining outside, so it's re getting really cloudy. But this drawer just has my other palettes. I only have three in here. That's one thing I would like to get more of. I want to expand my palette collection. But I have an e.l.f. one, a Lorac one, and a NYX one. And then this next drawer is all of my makeup bags. Pretty self-explanatory. And then the bottom drawer has sample products or products I haven't opened yet. Like I bought a new BB cream. Um, I have like these Urban Decay primer samples. And then in the back is just two extra bins in case I want to reorganize. And then next to it, we have this little thing. My great-great-grandpa actually built this, so it's very special to our family, but I just have a little bit more of makeup on the top. This little bag has my moisturizer, my eye creams, my zit cream, things like that And here. I like to keep it in a bag because I can use it in here or I can just bring it to the bathroom if I'm going to do my facial regimen in there. Then I have this three drawer organizer. This keeps my everyday makeup. So this is what I reach for on an everyday basis. Up here I have the oh. Up here I have the Maybelline BB cream, the Maybelline cover stick, the Maybelline Age Rewind foundation the Maybelline Master Conceal. Apparently I really love Maybelline face products. And this NYX Wonder Stick, which I love so much. And then in here I have the Naked Basics Palette, the Revlon Photo Ready Powder, a Bare Minerals Blush and Bronzer Duo, and then the NYC Sunny Bronzer. And then I've got, let's see, the e.l.f. Primer, the Bad Gal Liner from Benefit, the Their Real Mascara from Benefit, the NYX Gel Liner, another liner from e.l.f., and I have the Their Real Liner, a lot of liners in here, and then I have a Rimmel Brow Gel and a Bare Minerals Flawless Definition Mascara. And then this little bin is my everyday brushes. That I reach for on an everyday basis. So that is pretty much it for my makeup collection. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you have any other video requests, leave them down below. Don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!